Hello learners, in this video, we are going to learn about food or basic need. So student, before we start with the explanation, I have a question for you. What is food? Why do we need food? Do living things need food? Yes, all living things need food. We eat food in order to survive. Food gives us energy for doing different activities such as studying, playing, walking, dancing, etc. And dear children, we eat different types of food like wheat, rice, vegetables, fruits, etc. The food that we eat contains substance that help our body to grow and stay healthy. And these substances are called as nutrients. The main nutrients found in the food item are carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins, and minerals. Beside this food, it also contains roughage and water. Now let us have a look on these nutrients in details. So first is carbohydrates. Carbohydrates give us energy to walk and to play. Therefore, carbohydrates is also known as energy giving food. The food items that are rich in carbohydrates are sugar, wheat, bread, corn, potatoes, and sweet potatoes. People who do a lot of physical work such as laborers, farmers, and sport person need a lot of carbohydrates in his or her diet than a person who sits and walks in office all day. Next is proteins. Proteins are nutrients that help the body to grow and repair the damaged parts. Hence, proteins are known as bodybuilding food. The food items that are rich in proteins are milk, product, cheese, egg, meat, fish, and pulses. Young children need more protein-rich food than adults because they are still growing. The next one is fats. Fats are present in food items such as butter, ghee, oil, nuts, and cheese. Fats also give us energy. They provide more energy than carbohydrates. Fats help us to keep our body warm. Let's have a look at the next one that is vitamins. Vitamins protect our body from diseases and keep us fit and healthy. Hence, they are known as protective food because they protect us from diseases. Food items such as fresh fruit, vegetables, milk, egg, and peanut are rich in vitamin. There are many types of vitamins that our body need like vitamin A, vitamin B, vitamin C, vitamin D, vitamin E, and vitamin K. So first, we will talk about vitamin A. Vitamin A improves eyesight and keep our skin healthy. Green leafy vegetables, tomatoes, carrot, and milk are some sources of vitamin A. Next is vitamin C. Vitamin C keeps our gums and teeth healthy. Vitamin C is essential for healthy skin. And citrus fruits like lemon, amla, orange are all good sources of vitamin C. Next is vitamin D. Vitamin D helps in proper absorption of calcium in our body. And sun rays are the main sources of vitamin D. 
Next is minerals. Minerals help in the growth and development of the body. Calcium, iron, potassium, iodine, and sodium are some examples of minerals. Now let us discuss some different types of minerals that are very useful for our body. So first one is calcium. Calcium helps in the formation of bone and teeth. Food items such as milk, cut, almond, and cheese are rich in calcium. Next mineral is iron. Iron helps in the formation of blood. Green leafy vegetables and dry fruits are rich in iron. Beside all these nutrients, we also take roughage and water in our diet. So, roughage is the fiber present in our body. It makes our digestion smooth and easy. It means it helps to remove waste material from our body. And raw fruits and vegetables are good sources of fiber. So the next one is water. Water is very important part of our diet. Water helps in the proper digestion and growth of the body. Our body releases water in the form of sweat and urine. Water helps to regulate our body temperature. And most important thing, we must drink at least 6 to 8 glasses of water every day. The next is balanced diet. So first of all, let us understand what is a diet. The food we eat is called a diet. And we know that our food contains nutrients like carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins, and minerals. So the right amount of all these nutrients in right proportion is called a balanced diet. And here are the picture which shows some food items that make a balanced diet. And in order to stay healthy, we should eat food items from each of these food group daily. So this is all about this chapter that is chapter 6, Food Our Basic Need. I hope this video is of help to you. Thank you for watching.